I've had this come up over the years where they weren't necessarily thinking about the CPA route, but it wasn't because they weren't interested in doing accounting. They were. They were interested in doing an accounting role um, after graduation, and they were accounting majors or were considering accounting majors, but they, they had some self-doubt. They were like, oh, I don't know. Maybe I can get my degree in accounting. I can probably get my degree in accounting. But I think the CPA is like out of reach. I think that perhaps my skill set or, you know, just saying it plainly in student language, I'm not smart enough to become a CPA. What would you say to those students? Um, I'm going to say if you made it through Dell Accounting, you can do it. You are smart enough. You have the tools. You have the resources. Dell's accounting program, I'm, whether you've, you're in it now or you've made it through, looking back, you know it's hard work. You put in the work. You put in the time. You were able to get through and show up. And you having sort of that outlook and even those tools, as I said, to do that at Dal, the next, whether you do sort of the, the modules, core one, core two, whatever you may do, you have the tools to get through. It's a mindset. And if you are interested in doing accounting after, the only thing holding you back is yourself. And I think you would regret that for, I don't want to, I don't want to be dark, but potentially the rest of your life. If you did that on a decision of self-doubt, um, I would say just go full out. You you've you've made it this far. It's so it's so in reach for you that just keep going. You you can do it 100%. Yeah. No, I love that. Yeah. And the thing is, if the reason for you not doing it is self-doubt, throw that away. Exactly. There's if, other reasons. Yeah. You know. If you don't love accounting and yeah. you don't find it interesting, you can't see yourself in a role, I'm not going to sugarcoat it maybe don't put yourself through because it, it is time consuming effort. If you hate accounting and you're like, I'm only doing like, why am I doing this? I don't see passion. You don't see yourself. I maybe not. And that's totally fine. It's not everyone's path. And as I said, it is time consuming, but if you're the only reason that you wouldn't be doing it is because you don't have the confidence, throw that away. And yeah, Fabulous. no, <laughs> no, no. Fabulous. Yeah. Yeah. And I would even say, if you're unsure, but you're like, oh, well, um, so <laughs> I'll say for me, I wasn't quite sure. There was nothing pulling me somewhere else. And so I was like, well, I don't know. It's like a relatively short time commitment if you're willing. And if you don't even use it for the rest of your life, it's kind of right. what I, I would put on there is if like, you're not like, if you're like, oh, I like accounting, but you're like, I can't see myself in an accounting role for the rest of my life. I'd be like, it's okay. Like there's so many things that you can use this degree for. You can right. use it to be an accountant or you can use it to like quote pivot. Um, you know, we have some of our former students who just recently got their CPAs and will be going and pursuing a marketing degree. So like a marketer, awesome. marketing exec with number knowledge. Yeah. Any like, accounting knowledge is so valuable in the business world. Like you can understand the entire company, you know, what's going on. It is, it's so valuable. And yeah, as you said, you don't need to stay in accounting CPA or just accounting in general, the door like opens so, so many other opportunities for you. So yeah, it's, it is really valuable and interesting how so many paths can sort of um, pop up for you or you can divert and change whenever you want. Yeah. So yeah. Cool. So I, I do.